Thank you, Mr. President. Members, it is with great sadness that I ask that we adjourn today in the memory of Marilyn Alcantar, a resident of San Bernardino. Marilyn was born and raised on the west side of San Bernardino, where she attended school, met her husband, and raised her four children. She was a passionate advocate for children and education, and she worked for over a decade at Ramona Alessandro Elementary School in San Bernardino. It was while working at the school that she began to, tech, to detect gas fumes and traced it back to the refueling station across the street. Marilyn became a tireless advocate for the health of the children at the school and residents of the community. Without any previous organizing experience, she led massive outreach efforts to inform others of the environmental risks and community threats stemming from the refueling station. Initially being called mommies in tennis shoes due to mothers running in the middle of the night to track down gas leaks, Marilyn led with tenacity over in an over 20 year effort to advocate for environmental justice in her community. In a very real sense, Marilyn was a woman warrior. In late 2017, Marilyn lost her battle with cancer, but won the hearts and minds of hundreds of new leaders as they followed in her legacy to continue for the West Side. I would also like to take an opportunity to briefly add to this adjourn in memory by also remembering two other women warriors that fought for environmental justice in San Bernardino. Sally Marana, who passed away from cancer in, early in the early 2000s, and Jan Miski, who also died from cancer in 2009. Marilyn, Sally, and Jan fought hard to protect their community. These women were truly environmental justice heroes in the Inland Empire. It is for Marilyn Alcantar and also Sally Marana and Justice Jan Miskew that I ask that we adjourn in memory of these amazing women today. Thank you, Mr. President. Thank you. Please pass along our deep sympathies, Senator Leva. Thank you.